Yo, what is going on guys? It is your boy Paradox today. I'm going to be showing you how to set up the trap, which is pretty much really easy on the map Genesis. And the thing is with this trap, you're going to die a lot. This is pretty much like a COD 4 shipment domination game. You're going to get a lot of kills, but you're going to get like at least 30 to 40, maybe if you're lucky, get 20 deaths. You know, I wish I could get the 20 deaths, but instead, you know, Usually when I play this, you, you run into sweats. So usually you about die uh, about 40 times, 30 times at the most. Hopefully, like, it depends how if you can get the trap in. But, um, the trap is really simple on the defending side. We're going to start on the defending side first. With the sentry gun placements, really, you just need to put them outside of the building so they can't get out of the building. But you're going to need them to get a bomb. You'll want them to have A or A bomb or B bomb. It doesn't really matter. But then... You see me and Korean over here, and I'm going to get in this corner. Actually, we're going to switch over here. We're going to switch in a minute. And he, they just spawn right there. They'll spawn right there in front of you, but it depends if everybody's in there. Or say they're at our spawn point. They're going to say, like, it depends. If, if you stand on top of the spawn, like, see, they're just spawning in here with me now. It's in, it's insane. Now, see, this is a really one, good one right here. They're going to spawn right here in front of me. But you need to at least have two people, three people in there just to have your back. They'll spawn right here in this little alley right here where I'm in right now. They'll spawn right there. And they'll spawn right there in that corner. And they'll spawn right between the desk and that little, I don't even know, there's like a little section between a desk and a thing. And then they'll spawn straight down that hallway where you can get in that corner like the domination. Genesis trap on, you know, where you put the sentry guns in the dome and everything inside, you know, and you'll... Just shoot them from the back, and this is a quick way to get, you know, like camos. And I went through the light machine gun camos. I went through all the headshots on the raw, and then the Titan Warden, probably in about an hour. And that's like a hundred. That's a hundred and no, that's like three hundred and twenty headshots right there. And it's just. It's just so good. This trap is so good, but again, you do die a lot, and. In my opinion, I do like the attacking side a little bit better than the defusing side or defending side. But, you know, it's still a pretty overpowered trap. Like I said, you see where that guy spawned. You're going to want at least three people watching in there. So that, like, they're y'all are going to be lined up on that back wall, the glass wall. And in the class, I prefer, you know, you see me, like last night, y'all saw me, K, and uh, some other people. Everybody was using the uh, Raw Liberty. You have infinite ammo. You got infinite ammo pretty much. And it's just that weapon is such an overpowered weapon. It's not even funny. And what you're going to want to run on it is the ELO. Well, it really depends on you. What I put on it is ELO, grip, quick draw, suppressor, and I put in fast mag. And you see right now, I'm using the Cerberus, but I do switch from the... I switch, I switch it up. It all depends. But like, you see, I'm just spawning right there. But make sure you kill him fast enough. I wasn't killing him fast enough. Just because I, I'm... I was... This was like, like 3 o'clock in the morning. The grind don't stop, you know what I mean? We went up like 6 spots last night. And we... Hopefully we're in the top page in about, you know, I, I'm going to estimate probably about two or three weeks. You know, I still got school and everything. So, you know, everybody that's on the leaderboards above me, they probably, they got eight hours, like, they got eight hours on me every day. And I only play for six hours a day on a weekday just because I have to, you know, get, go to sleep for a decent time to go to school. But, you know, this is my last year of going to high school. And I'm gonna be grinding the crap out of the next Call of Duty, but you know we're gonna we're gonna try for number one next year. Hopefully we're gonna get like I want to get in at least the top three this year, but it's gonna be hard. I know, but you know I can if you can achieve stuff, you just gotta put your mind to it, and then hopefully it goes your way. But um, I just want to talk about now. I want to talk about the attacking side. So let's get into that. Okay, so now we're on the attacking side. So I'm gonna bring out the raw liberty. So this this is the fate my favorite side and then really this is what you got to do for this side you got to have to plant a bomb you need to a bomb and then they're only gonna like they're gonna spawn there but they spawn heavier like we like getting them kills me and k we have to get for them kills and score uh leaderboards so we need as many kills as we can at every second so you're gonna just want to come over here and I prefer you can stand right there but you seen that guy spawn I I just saw him in the right corner of my eye but they're gonna spawn right here in front of me and I just figured out this is the best spot to be at 
And see, they just spawn like crazy, man. I'm telling y'all. I bring out a couple weapons. I, I just couldn't bring, I couldn't, you know, just figure out a weapon to use. But the Raw Liberty is probably the best weapon to use. You know, I saw just because, you know, and another thing is with the perking system, just run Scavenger on like, if you're running on the Liberty, just run Fusion Mag. And if you're running like any other gun, don't use Hardline because you're only getting 25 more points. And really just use, you know, scavenger so you can stay up more and you don't run out of ammo. Because I do run out of ammo a lot when I was using the Cerberus, which is the E-Red. And I like that gun. It's pretty nice. But it does run out of ammo, like I said, pretty quick. So you're going to want to run scavenger. Hardline, you know, like I said, it gives you 25 points. But, you know, I don't I don't think you should just run hardline. And what I, what I was running hardline on this class is because I'm one of my hardcore classes. But, you know, like I said, if I made the mistake of running hardline... And, you know, I ran out of ammo and I died. So, I'm just letting y'all know. Just run Scavenger. It's really going to help you. And, literally, there's no scav Like, for the attacking side, like I said, you need to plant a bomb and let it explode. <clears throat> and you're going to need to just get into that spawn as fast as you can. Get to the spot like I'm going to show you in a minute. It's really... I like this spot. It's kind of easier to, you know, not get killed. But you can get killed if you're by yourself. So make sure... You see that there's a little pillar right there. And you're going to get behind it, really. That's all you have to really do. You can get behind both of them. But let me... I, like, you just can't be here by yourself. It's it's really dumb to be here by yourself. Because it's pretty much when they spawn, there's about six of them. They'll spawn right on top of each other. And you can't kill them all. It's just hard. This ain't like the precinct trap where you could just like get behind them and it's easy. Like constantly kill, 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 kill constantly. But um, I wanna I'm gonna let y'all enjoy the rest of this gameplay. Um, I wanna say thank y'all for 1,800 subs. We're getting closer and closer to 2K. That means we're getting closer and closer to 10K and then so on and so forth. But um, I'm gonna be live streaming a little bit later. I, it's not gonna be a long stream like these ones been. The like Friday night and Saturday night. I have school in the morning, so I wish I didn't have school, you know. But anyways, um, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, share this around, cause I'm pretty sure, you know, and what is it? Just go into, uh, get into the comments, go into the comments, and you know, party up and try this, you know, just try this, and you know, at me on Twitter. My Twitter's gonna be in the description. Just at me a picture of you like dropping a hundred or dropping like a 10k score. I want to see them, you know. But anyways, I'm going to let y'all enjoy the rest of this gameplay. Like I said, you know, if you're new to the channel, please subscribe, and I'll catch y'all then. Peace out. Why are we spawning here? Yeah, we're spawning here. That's 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 Enemy not. Enemy UAV in your vicinity. I remember I remember the first time we played on this. Yeah, we were screaming. I have to go. Start doing the thing where uh, friendly drone support is active. We're losing. Clean it up in the next round.
sorry, I think I have a good on this side. I have a nice old shank. Yeah, we'll get that. Yeah, yeah. yeah, we have plenty of time. Just don't care. Plus are going for uh no. Nah. We just need um we need this guy needs to get two more kills and we have a triple one hundred. One more kill and oh uh, we got a triple one hundred. And that's how we bob and weave. So easy, bro. <laughs> oh, uh. 